One of the toughest parts of the jerk is driving long enough instead of rushing the movement down under the bar. A helpful way to think of the motion is in terms of the rhythm of the dip and drive. We naturally tend to equalize the timing of down and up when we actually need to drive longer than we dip. This is primarily true in terms of distance. We need to continue driving up higher than our starting position. It's also true of timing. We can dip really quickly, but no matter how explosive we are, it takes time to begin driving back up again and finish accelerating the bar. And again, we have to cover more distance. Keep in mind the rhythm of the drive being longer than the dip as you prepare and execute the lift.